Alright. This is Squirtle 210. Now, I promised one George and K another tutorial on my Super Mario 64 text edit because he had a few problems. Now, I'm going to do a full tutorial on it this time, not sped up, no music, I'm going to tell you all with commentary. Alright, so first you want to open your folder with Super Mario 64 in it. Uh, ignore that, that's just where I'm recording this dude. So you want the Super Mario 64 ROM, you want Super Mario 64 ROM extender, you want Super Mario 64 text edit. Now what you want to do is, to extend it, you want to drag your Super Mario 64 ROM into Super Mario 64 ROM Extender. Run it. Open a ROM and open that. Now just wait until it finishes all this. It'll decompress everything and move it. It basically makes a copy of it and extends it so it can be edited. And just close it when it's done. Then just, you can cut them if you want, which I'm going to do because I like them in the original folder. Cut and paste, there. Now to edit the text, you want to open Super Mario 64 Text Wrangler. And it'll ask you to open the extended file. Open that one, and it'll come up with all this. Now I'll quickly go over some of the things this can do. Alright, so this is on the first star. Very, very simple. So let's just edit it. Hold it and delete. Now if you want to go back to the original, just select the one and click revert selected. And it'll revert it. Now, let's type this is a test. Now watch over here when it gets to about here you want to do enter otherwise it'll go off I think I'm sure they'll fix the bug so this is a test for Super Mario 64 text editor Wow. See when you do U, you'll put it in brackets over here. Now you can just put things like the, U, star, etc. Oh. You'll smack in the middle of a big bad bomb. Bob um uh war I guess. Now you can save that. Now there are actually different things you can do in this version. You can do levels and acts and dialogues. So let's go to levels. One Bob Bom Yeah, Bob OMG. That'll do. And that's called the first act. Test of fun. Now see up there, that shows how many characters you have left, including spaces and letters. And full stops and everything else. That shows your current, and that shows how many you have left. What? See, when I take a space, that goes to 14, that goes to 12. Backspace, duh. Now, I think you have to put it all in capitals. I'm not completely sure, so I'm just gonna do that with this. Bob. OMG. Bob. OMG. Save. Now, close it. Go back to Super Mario 64 and open the EXT file.
Now, if it does that, like it likes to, just click OK. This is what I usually do. It always does it to me. I just go File, Open ROM, Open the EXT, and it'll open it. And that is very, very loud on my ears. So let's go. No, we don't want that. I'll include a link for Project 64 version 1.6, the Super Mario 64 ROM, and all the tools you'll need to do what I have done in this tutorial. Now, I'll make a new file, so I'm just going to cut till the cutscene's over. Right, we're here. Now, let's head off to the castle. Now, I haven't changed any uh, other text apart from the one in bob -omb Battlefield. Ugh. BRB, I'll meet you at the painting. Let's -a go! Now, let's see if it works. Now, sometimes it won't. See? Oh, I forgot the B. Test of fun. Ob OMG. This is a test for Super Mario 64 text editor. Wow, you're smacking. You're smack in the middle of a big bad bomb -bomb war. That proof enough for you? Actually, I want to show you something else you can change. To Super Mario 64, text edit. Right, so when you reopen it, it will still have every change you've made. See? Now, you can even edit what Peach says at the start. Dear Mario, um, what am I gonna write? I have been captured. I have been captured for the mm, not the first time. How about the tenth? folder so we can see the opening. Now she won't actually speak the other words. Castle, I have baked a cake for you. Yeah, so she won't actually, it won't actually change the audio, so uh, you probably already guessed that by now, but yeah, it won't change the audio. Now, quick up to finish off this tutorial, I'm just going to show a few other things you can do with other than now up here is from Yoshi Electron, color code generator, scroll message generator, and activator. I haven't really worked out the app. The color code generator allows you to make color codes. It's a big surprise. All credit goes to Yoshi Electron. I'll include a link to his website or channel. Well, I'll include a link to both in the description get these programs here. Right, so let's make a Disco Mario. We'll have him... Um, let me think. 
Right, I'm back, sorry. Right, sorry about that, uh, I just realized my microphone was up. It was, so you probably wouldn't have been able to hear me that well before. So anyways, this is C. James S. Yoshi Electron. Now, let's make his overalls red. His caps arms and shirt a bright green. His gloves can be bright white. His shoes can be black. Face can be, uh, what the heck, purple. And hair can be yellow. Now you just click on add once on each of them. Select and copy code, and you can close it. Then open a ROM file. Any file you can still put in cheats to the EXT. It just doesn't have any cheats currently on it. Open cheats, make sure you have advanced on advanced um you want to go to settings you want to go to options and you want to untick hide advanced settings to put cheats on now let's add new cheat um disco 2 I don't know I'm not sure why out of the two I think I have another disco mario for a tutorial that failed Twenty-one stars. Sorry, I just realized my microphone was up again, and uh, stop my music still playing. But there we go. We look like Mario. Sorry, I keep putting my microphone up for some reason. So I'll just be boosting the audio in editing. So you should be able to hear me now properly. I don't know. See, since the star man's still active, it just doesn't show the coloring. We can jump like this on one jump. Um. Might as well show off the Starman code. I'll meet you in Bob on Battlefield. Here we go. Let me in. Sheesh, how hard is it to get in a single painting? Alright. So you may not see the flashing colours, but Mario does flash. And since there's no colour code, then well, he'd normally have Koopa Sparkles coming behind him. Like when you're riding on a Koopa shell, you'd have those sparkles. So yeah, I'm gonna end off this tutorial now. Bye.